Rated M for Mature. Game of Thrones fans playing the Telltale games will flesh out that all-immersive experience of what Westeros is. You get to be a part of it and we'll get a little bit more of the world. You get to choose what happens. You can get involved and create your own storyline. You get to go on um, a series of adventures that are determined by you, the player. So you can create your own storyline involving Daenerys and her dragons. My character, Marjorie Terrell, is one of the principal characters that the gamer meets. Mira Forrester is um, a handmaiden of Marjorie Terrell. It's great the gamer gets to interact directly with the wannabe queen of Westeros. Allies and enemies can be made with every move, yet they say it is men who are powerful. My character, Ramsay, basically involved in the same way as he is in the show, generally causing havoc around Westeros. Roderick! We've had a lovely time together. Say it. Say it's been lovely. Well, I think it's just magical that you, as the player, can determine your own fate within the realms of Game of Thrones, the show that we know. It fleshes out Westeros more, which is, is fun for fans of the, the show and the game. You two will join Croft and his men, get them into the city, help them liberate Marine, and I will see that you are rewarded. There's like repercussions to every decision that you make, so I think it's a really interesting way of approaching a game. You can get involved and create the way that you would do it, so as opposed to just shouting at the television, you can, you can take action and do it yourself. Has this wonderful ability of uh, giving a Game of Thrones fan the experience of meeting these different characters, going to these different places, and really expanding their enjoyment and richness of the Game of Thrones experience. They get to be a part of the show, which if you, if you love a show that much, then that's kind of a wonderful experience. Mm -hmm.